Okay, y'all, if you're ready to get started with this look, I'm, I've already primed my lid with um, Too Faced Shadow, <clears throat> Shadow Insurance. And as a base, I used uh, Max Groundwork. And I did that from my lash line all the way up to my brow also. Um, I went ahead and moisturized my lips with Blistics Deep Renewal. And the first color I'm going to go in with is Sorcery by MAC. And it's this one right here, that Sorcery. It's kind of a, a red-brown, or brown-red, red-brown. And I'm going to take a little bit on my brush, and I'm just going to work this into my crease and kind of work it upwards. Just like so. And I'm going to do that with both of them, and I'll be right back. Okay, so that's what it looks so looks like so far with Sorcery by MAC. Um, then I'm going to go in on the, um, just basically the outer portion, this V part, into my crease and up right in here on the outer part with uh, the color Humid, which is this one here. And I'm going to take that and basically um, just do my V and then just work it up and kind of overlapping on the sorcery just like so and I'm going to do that with both eyes and then I'll be right back okay this is what it looks like so far it's kind of harsh looking you can tone it down just a tiny bit by by steady blending it but I don't mind the darkness of it um, it's more like a smoky eye basically Okay, the next color I'm going to go in with um, for my inner tear duct all the way across the rest of my lid is going to be this color by MAC. It's called Sumptuous Olive. And I'm going to take that and put that um, just on my lid. And I'm patting that on. and blending it over into the humid on the bottom portion of my lid. Just like so. Then with that um, brush that I used the humid with, I'm going to kind of blend these colors right here. Just like so. So you still have that that kind of brownish red brown or brownish red going into the um, humid up here, and then you have the sumptuous olive that's kind of gradiating into the humid on the bottom. Humid on the bottom. Okay, <clears throat> finish up this look. I'm gonna take uh, the color brulee by MAC, or you can use Blanc Type, whichever one you want, but this is Brulee. I'm going to use this as a highlight color, and I'm going to take that and place it right here, and working it down into the um, Sorcery, that brown color, and um, the Humid. Don't get too much on like I just did. Just like so. And just working it down into those colors. Just like that. Okay, I'm going to line everything up and then I'll be right back so don't go anywhere. Okay, y'all, I'm back with the final look. I've lined everything up. Um, on my lower lash line, I applied um, this uh, sea green pencil from Jordana. It's a green, a really dark hunter green. I applied that under my lash line. 
And then on top of that, I went in with Humid. And then I lined everything up with um, a black eyeliner pencil. On my upper lash line, I used Wet n Wild 886 in black, a gel liner. Um, my mascara was the L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. On my lips, I lined my lips with Plum by MAC, which is that color there. This is Plum. You probably can't. There, that's Plum by MAC. Filled it in on the sides and stuff. And then um, on the center of my lip, I used the uh, Smoky Shadow Blast by CoverGirl, I think. Yeah. And this light color here. It's an eyeshadow, but I use it. I only use this for my lips. I never use it on my eyes. I just, I didn't like it for my eyes, but I do like it as um, just a focal point for my lips. No, um, no lip gloss. Decided not to put me on. And um, so this is it. Um, I contoured a little bit with blunt. You know, I'm not good at contouring. But this is the final look. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this look and you try it out. This is a recreation um, from um, a guru on YouTube by the name of... Um, hmm. I can't think. I will have to link it below. But this is a recreated look that she had done. Um, sexy Candy Eyes. Ha ha, I do remember. Sexy Candy Eyes. Hers is a lot better. But I just used what I had. Um, the Humid and the Sumptuous Olive she used. But um, I didn't have the two browns that she mixed together. So I just used Sorcery. Um, so... Take a look at her video. I'll link um, her YouTube channel below somewhere. But it is. It, uh, she's called Sexy Candy Eyes. Um, and she's a MAC makeup artist. Um, but she's also here on YouTube. So check her out. Okay. Well, you guys have a great day. I am fixing to go eat lunch with my mother. Um, I will come back and let you know how these instylers do. Um, I played around with them this morning. Um... I don't know for sure if I'm really going to like this. Um, I just have to get used to doing my hair like a pin curl, which I have real big fingers, so it's really hard because my hair is not long at all. But um, this is, uh, I took one of them out, and this is what it looks like so far. Hopefully it won't look like a, a big afro or a big frizz when I get done with it. I just don't like the bottoms of it because it's so just like, I'll have to figure out how to use it. But anyways, I'll be back. All right, well, you guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Deuces, y'all. Bye. Hey, y'all, I'm back. I took the in-stylers out, um, or the top stylers. My stomach is growling. I took the stop. I took the top stylers out and just fingered my hair. How does that sound? I just fingered my hair. Um, I fingered my hair, and this is what it looks like. Uh, like I said, you have to pin curl it. Um, I'm not crazy about it, but um, it was kind of flat because I had washed it this morning and air dried it for a little while, and then I blow I blow dried the rest of it, and it was really flat. Uh, this has a little bit of volume to it. So, yeah, I am i don't know if I'm crazy about this look too much. It's kind of like I just woke up and just fingered my hair and just said, okay. But um, I've got to work with them um, and figure out how to actually use them to my benefit. You know, that would benefit me. But, um, yeah, I don't have, I don't want to curl it with a curling iron right now. Um, but this part is really kind of like frizzy. But... We'll see what happens throughout the day because, you know, here in here in Florida, in Panama City, especially the humidity will have your hair jacked up from the floor up. So we'll see what happens today. OK, well, um, this is just um, a small I'm not this isn't a review on the in styler. 
I am actually um, going to figure out how to work it to my advantage and um, then I will do a full review on it. I'll be using it every day for the next couple of weeks just to see what I need to do to make this uh, work for me. Okay, well you guys have a great day and I will see you soon. Deuces y'all. Bye.